We got the brief two weeks into total lockdown. At that time, it sort of revolved around the concept of a film for the people by the people. Basically, user generated lah. First round with clients, my initial board was rejected because it might just lose relevance once the lockdown is lifted. We went back and we had a new board, drawn. We did some test shots just to set expectations and there would be pineapple tarts, the set grandmother who ends up doing some TikTok, a spectacular drone show finale, well you all know I have a thing with drones. We had started casting and I felt pretty confident but when it came down to it, agency changed their minds. We're back to square one, on to board number three. So this new idea was a lot punchier but also meant weeks of planning were literally reduced to less than three days of prep. So overnight, a script was finally in place and the talents were confirmed just two days before shoot. And by this time, we managed to wrangle location photos of their houses and have our art director source out props to be sent out in time. While shooting was a lot of fun. Can you just record the playback for us, the last one? I don't think I recorded that last one. <laughs> <laughs> Figuring out lighting plots, um, getting the right exposure, uh, making sure everything was focused, that was like the most difficult task. So a simple setup took hours, but once it was in place, shooting was pretty fast as our talents performed beyond our expectations. All in all, it took close to five days of sleepless nights, moving from set to set virtually. A wooden ladder! A wooden ladder! A wooden ladder is better than No, seriously, it's getting higher, Hadi. Once we got the cameras back, we spent the final day shooting the close-ups and inserts in our home. I guess at first, figuring out how to direct on Zoom, I was screaming a lot. Turned out I had my mic on mute. But everyone pretty much pulled their weights and made this shoot happen. Thank you to our editor who worked overnight for our presentation and our composer came on board soon after. We were really lucky we got to score the picture which kind of really helped elevate the film. And since the whole idea of this film was to make everyone seem like they were in the same space, we give major props to our colorist and also to our online artist and our sound designer which made the film look so rich. to a point where we were accused of defying the lockdown law and shooting on set which I repeat, we did not. Like, what the heck? And that's how we shot a commercial in lockdown.